There are two ways through life, the way of God and the way of Satan. I'm David Inchowskis from the Jesuit Post, and this is my One Minute Reflection. Today we celebrate the solemnity of Jesus Christ, King of the Universe. Curiously, in the spiritual exercises, St. Ignatius of Loyola has us consider this king and the kingdom that he's setting up, but also he has us consider an opposing kingdom, the kingdom of Satan. It's our job to choose which king and which kingdom we're going to follow. If we choose the kingdom of God, we become prophets. And prophets do three things. First, prophets denounce what they see as the anti-reign. Second, prophets propose an alternative vision that combats the evils of this anti-reign and sets up good things in its place. And third, prophets take specific actions to make this vision a reality. So what do we need to denounce in our world today? We need to denounce the separation of children from their families at the border. We need to denounce the lack of health care for all people. But for each of these things that we must denounce, we must also announce the good thing that ought to stand in its place. We are called to announce the right to the freedom of movement. We are called to announce God's plan for access to health care for all. What are we doing for Christ and his kingdom? What will we do for Christ and his kingdom?